Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to install AnyDesk on Ubuntu. If you are using Ubuntu, you might notice that AnyDesk is not available in the Ubuntu Software Center, so we need to install it manually. Let's start. First, open your web browser and go to the AnyDesk website. You can find the download link by searching for AnyDesk Ubuntu Download on Google. Click on the first link to reach the download page. On the download page, scroll down and find the section for Debian, Ubuntu and Mint. Click on the link for the 64-bit version to start downloading the AnyDesk package. The file is around 5.9 MB. Once the download is complete, open your terminal. To navigate to the Downloads folder where the file is located, type CD Downloads and press Enter. Now you should see the AnyDesk bot deb file in your Downloads folder. To install it, use the command sudo dpkj i anydesk asterisk dot deb. Press enter and then type your sudo password when prompted. Next, you need to add the gpg key for the anydesk repository. Copy the command provided in the description and paste it into the terminal. Press enter to execute it. After adding the gpg key, you need to add the anydesk repository to your system. Copy the relevant command from the description, paste it into the terminal, and press Enter. Now, update your package list to include the new repository. Use the command sudo apt update and press Enter. This will refresh your package list. Finally, install AnyDesk by typing sudo apt install AnyDesk and pressing Enter. Confirm the installation if prompted. Once the installation is complete, you can run AnyDesk. Open the application menu, search for AnyDesk, and open it. You will see the AnyDesk interface where you can set up remote connections. If this video helped you out, make sure to join the Show Me Software free newsletter. It's linked in the description below. In this newsletter, I will tell you about the latest software tools and AI that can make you more productive at work and also improve your personal life in many different ways. You can also reply to these emails with any technical support questions you might have and I'll do my best to help you out for free. This newsletter is completely free and will always be free. So click the link in the description to sign up.